Here's a quick lesson on Third Stone from the Sun by Jimi Hendrix. We're going to start out with this chord up here. It's going to be 11 and 11 on the 5th and 4th strings, and then you get a 9 and you get a 12. We're using the big string and the little string open with that. Now this one we're going to mute the big E, but we're still going to hit all the rest of those other 5 strings. That's 9, 9, 7, 10, open. So once again we got... And then we have this little riff here. So it's open on the big one and then five and seven. Eight times of that riff. We've got this new riff. We got seven and seven on the middle strings and then eight and then open on the bottom. So it takes a lot of curve in that finger to get that to happen. Now that's going to be 7 and 8 with the open on the bottom. So it's like... So that's the same type of thing. You got the open going with all these. 5 to 7 and back. And then 3 to 2. Back to the chords, but this time, only once on that, right to that one. When you hit that one, if you count four, that would keep you in time with the band where you could do this riff three times. So once again, that would be only once, one, two, three, four, three times of this riff. Then we got a new riff. This is four, zero, and zero on the bottom three strings. So you're keeping the opens going, you're going four, two, open, two, four, five, four, two, four, and then you do it again. Four, two, open, two, and then you're going to go. So that's sliding from the two to the four on the G string, and then hitting three and open on the bottom two, and the little hammer in back there. Sliding back to the open on the G and then to the E note on the D string. So we got. And then we hit that low E and then we got a little sliding octave thing. We're going to do ninth fret on the A string with 11th fret on the G string. Slide up to the 11. So once again, that was 9 to 11, hold that a little bit, and then slide up again, and then to the back to the 9, slide down to the 7, 7 to 9 then, and then 4 to 7, and then we're going to go 5, 4, 2, 2 to 4 then, and then bigger strings, 4 to 7, so bigger strings then, 4 here on the big string, and 6 on the D string. Four up to seven, and then seven to nine, and back, and then down the string. So once again on that slidey riff, we got. And then we'll do that little tag riff again. Now we're gonna do that same lower riff and go into the solo. Once again, same ending on that 4 2 0 oh, 2. And then we're going to do that. But instead of getting into the rest of that riff here, we're going to jump up higher. So it's going to go. So that was sliding into the 14 on the D string. And then the 12s on the second and third strings. And the 14s. That was 14, 12, 14, and slide down to the low E. So we got. So two hits on the low E, and then you're going to bend that 15th fret of the B string. So we got, and then little string, you pull off on that 15 to 12. You're going to bend that 14, you can hit this 15 with your pinky on the way up. 
down to the small string. Another pull off, two bends up, and then down, pull off, 14th fret of the D string. So that was two low E's. That's hammer on. Then we're going to go to these nines in the middle strings. So that's kind of a D chord with an F sharp bass, but with that E bass going with it. So this is part of an E chord right there, kind of like your power chord, but we're not really playing that. We're just playing those nines right there. And that's like nine, seven, seven, seven. four times. Then you're back here sliding octaves riff. And at that point, it either does it again or it might just start going to those wild sound effects and things. It's about four minutes of wild sound effects on there. But anyway, that's the gist of Third Stone from the Sun, Jimi Hendrix. Once again, we got... what lower finger to use, you know. Kind of like the pinky myself. One more of those tags. Then we're going to that lower riff, the four zero zero, into the solo. Sliding octaves. Okay, one other interesting thing is the bass line when you first do that riff. After the song kind of stops and picks up again, it has like a different kind of a Latin kind of bass, bass groove. And what's interesting, if you ever play this like with a band or something, that sliding octaves riff will work over that more Latin type of feel thing too. Jimi Hendrix songs, Third Stone from the Sun. Please like and subscribe. More Hendrix coming up. Appreciate you.